Blaster here. Let's stop my intro. Jesus Christ. Hello there, it's Ballistic Blaster here, and today I am playing The Cunning. Uh, it's a pretty good game. I've played about 40 hours of it. I've been playing it mostly with Vampire Squid for 5. Uh, great friend of mine. Uh, link his channel in the description. Uh, not very good. I mean, I have one, as you can see by my pink balaclava, but I have a few things to go to. Let's let's go. Oh, my fists! My fists are lovely. Where? Oh, Jesus! My sensitivity. Oh, bear with me a second. Okay, there we go. Now my sensitivity is not trying to give me epilepsy. Let's get down here. What? I don't remember this. Jesus, they've had a pretty big update. What are you? Jesus. I haven't played in this update. Man. This is one big update. You're gonna hear a lot of button mashing. But yeah. Oh. Uh, what I was gonna talk about is there's a school that I've heard of in my in my in in the uh, in Sussex that it's called Warden Park and I've heard it's great at doing charity and it's raised like twelve thousand pounds every year for the last couple of years. But apparently they've just spent like seven hundred and fifty thousand pounds making an artificial football pitch. I don't, I don't know how you guys feel about that, but I feel that that's wrong. Go on, put your, put, put your opinion in the description below. Do you think it's wrong? Do you think it's right or wrong for this school to spend £750,000 on an artificial football pitch? What's happening? Well, I've de well, I'm dead. I'll be back when I get. Hello again. I'm back in a different game. I'm doing a bit better. I've got a bit more funk. I haven't died yet. I mean, I got caught in some snares that somebody set up. I'm just going to see if anybody's left anything behind here. I hope they have. Otherwise. I'm not going to win. Come on. No. Wow. A saber. 150 funk, but... Man. If I could get 150 funk, mate. That would be... Ideal. I can see that they didn't grab this. For whatever reason. Come on, come on, come on, come on, nice, 82, I don't need too much more, I just need a little bit more, then I can get a blue crate, and if I get a blue crate... Then I'm fairly set. Oh, boot pinata, hmm. Yeah, I just remembered. Yeah, I, I just remembered uh, I was going to do a little rant, wasn't I? I hear a person. I hear a person. Don't know where. It's fine, the guys run away. But, uh. I only forgot to loot this. You probably assumed that it was looted. 
Now I have a machete. I have enough to uh, open a good blue crate, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to. What I might do is I might go back to the other place and go get a. Uh, a saber because those are much better yeah I was going to talk about all this uh all the recent all the recent uh just the clickbait I'm I'm I mean I agree that if if you're a small channel then clickbait is clickbait I don't I if, if you're a small channel and you use clickbait I have nothing against you I mean you are a small channel. You need help setting off in life on YouTube. But when you're a big channel, i.e. the biggest channel on YouTube, PewDiePie, then you don't need. You don't need it. You just simply don't need it. Please be 150. Yeah. You, yeah, you just simply... Do not. You just simply do not need to do it. It's just ridiculous. Because if anybody's seen some of PewDiePie's most recent stuff, you don't need to do it. He doesn't need. He's 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 got so many subscribers. He just doesn't. He there is no reason for him to be using clickbait. Clickbait is not needed it just isn't i don't know who else agrees with me but i mean i mean i i have a bit of clickbait stuff i mean pokemon go and uh other stuff like that uh pretty uh mm, pretty clickbaity but i mean i have three subscribers I need the help, I need all the help I can get. So, just a little bit of clickbait can't hurt every now and again. But I mean, PewDiePie is the biggest channel on YouTube. He does not need it. He just simply does not need it. Very simply. Yeah, sorry if this if the commentary's not too good, but I'm not known for my commentary. I'm very new to the world of two tube. The middle has changed a lot as well since I last played. This game is so they expect me to be an absolute noob because this has changed a lot. And if you know if it, if any of you used to play this game, you'll know how I feel. Because, oh, I see a dude. So, there's five other guys. One of them is in the middle. I don't know if anybody else is down there. I can't tell. I don't want them to be down there. I don't know why I'm whispering. Because even if I shout, nobody can hear me scream. I'm going to just wait up here with my saber. Saber's tier, th yeah, tier 3. I'm going to wait here. And excuse me if I'm a bit quiet. I'm listening to noises in my headphones. Because I need to listen to know if anybody's coming. So there's that dude in the middle. We see something on the floor of there. I don't know whether you can see it. I'm going to point to it with the very tip of my spear. Yeah, just there, my spear is now poking it. Can't tell if that's something to pick up, a trap, a new trap that I've never seen before, or whether it's just a rock glitching through the map. My, bets is, my bet is that it's just a... Sorry, I thought I heard footsteps just this moment. My bet is that it's just a rock glitching through the map, but I mean... I haven't seen anybody else. I probably should have kept that man tracker. Oh, there's now four other people. I still see the 